Hello, I'm Foul Play Gaming, otherwise known as Charlie, and welcome to episode 28 of Coop Corner Chat. I hope you're all doing well. Now today is a fully packed video and it is all around the release of New World coming out on Tuesday the 28th of September. This video is going to round up all the things that you will likely want to know before it goes live. So let's have a look at the agenda for this video. To start with, we're going to talk about when you can pre-download the game in case you have slow internet and want to get it pre-downloaded before launch. If you haven't already seen the details of this, we're going to be talking about that first. We're then going to be talking about when the game is actually going live, depending on which region you're in. And we're going to talk about some of the complications based on what they've chosen to do. Then we're going to talk about the last minute giveaway details. So if you haven't already entered this month's giveaway to try and win one of three copies of New World, if you haven't already picked yours up, uh, we'll be talking about the details of how you can enter if if you haven't already. Uh, I'm then going to be talking about which server I'm going to be joining and which company I'm going to be joining and details about those should you wish to join me on my adventure. We're then going to be detailing the details of my 48 hour stream of New World and wh what you can expect from that. And to finish, I'm going to be discussing with you the future of the content you can expect to see on this YouTube channel for New World. Let's get straight into it then. So first then, when can you pre-download New World ready to go for the launch date? Well, if you haven't seen their official tweet on Twitter, really nice and simple, it's going to be available at 4 p.m. UK time on Monday, the 27th of September. If you wish to find out exactly what time that is for you, where you're from, simply just Google 4 p.m. UK time to whichever time you are on and you will see the time that you can pre-download the game. So make sure you get your pre-download started to make sure that the game is downloaded before go live so you can have a great experience getting in before the queues likely go high. Secondly then, when is the game actually going live? In case you missed the tweets that they posted yesterday detailing this, on screen is the image that they posted with the release times. Now, as you can see, it is a staggered start. So the first servers to be going live will be the EU servers going live at 8 a.m. Central Eastern, sorry, Central European Standard Time, which for those in the UK like me, we are one hour behind this. Uh, so we're gonna be at 7 a.m. in the morning. Uh, for those that are in America or any other continent, uh, you can see on the screen now what time frame your servers are launching. Now, this has caused a bit of controversy on uh, forums, comments, Reddit, etc. Uh, a lot of people are saying that EU servers are basically going to blow up uh, because a lot of people in the US, for example, uh, especially as it goes live at 11 p.m. on the 27th for their time, uh, a lot of them might end up jumping onto the EU servers just for five hours to mess around, maybe confirm their characters or just have a little bit of a play before it goes live on their servers and people are worried that everybody jumping on this bandwagon of the eu servers is going to cause essentially a ddos attack uh, on the servers to cause eu to have a really bad experience now i'm calling out to all people that are not going to be joining on the eu servers to not do this if possible now just to be clear a couple of things that new world have confirmed there is no point in making an eu character to save your name in case you want to make sure that you get a name all names are region locked meaning that if you wanted the name foul play gaming for example like i would want to do um if you have a character called Foul Play Gaming on EU, that does not mean that Foul Play Gaming is then taken in the US. So you do not need to make an EU character to save a name. Also, be careful about making an EU character because uh, there are going to be Prime drop skins if you have an Amazon Prime account, and apparently those are also region locked. So if you make your first character on a region that you don't intend to play and accidentally end up taking all those skins on that character, you will not be able to transfer them over to the, e uh, to the US servers. So my advice would be genuinely just wait until your server is up, be patient. It also gives the best experience to everybody. So now let's talk about the giveaway. So if you have already entered this month's giveaway, you probably already know these details, but if you have not yet entered to win one of your copies of New World, I'm giving away three, um, then make sure you listen to these details carefully. Now you can enter on behalf of a friend. So if you have New World, but you have a friend that doesn't, you're more than welcome to uh, enter into the giveaway. And if you win, you can pass the Steam code onto them. How to enter then? All you have to do is leave a comment, any comment on any of my New World videos and make sure you end your comment with the hashtag New World MMO. This video is included in that list, so you can just comment on this video if you would like. It's only one entry per person, so don't go commenting on every single video unless you just want to leave a comment. 
I'm going to be doing the draw on September the 27th at 4 p.m. UK time. This is the exact same time that the pre-download also launches. Once we've done the giveaway, you are welcome to redeem your Steam key and get the pre-download done for yourself, ready for go live less than, uh, sorry, a little bit more than 12 hours later. So I want to talk about now uh, which server I'm going to be joining on New World and which company I am part of should you, as someone in my community, want to join me. So the server that uh, the company that I'm in has decided to join is Helheim. I'll say that again, I'll write it nice and clearly, Helheim. So if you would like to join me in my adventure for New World, whether that's because you want to join me on Syndicate and be part of uh, my company or my faction, or whether you want to maybe go on Marauders or Covenant and actually try to, uh, you know, uh, rival me, uh, then Helheim is the server to go to. If you are going to be joining my server and you are going to be joining Syndicate and you would like to join my faction, my faction, sorry, my company, then the Discord link is down below. Uh, feel free to jump in the Discord before the game launches and get involved with the company to know that you are there. Um, the leader of the company is called Onith. He is another Twitch streamer. I will also link his uh, Twitch down below should you wish to engage with him. Um, we had a lot of fun with this company on this uh, faction uh, during the closed and open betas. Uh, so I'm, I'm fully aware that we're going to have a great time. So hopefully you guys will be joining me on that. Next then, I want to talk about the details of my 48 hour stream. So if you don't already know, I'm going to be doing a 48 hour stream. The reason for this is as a thank you to my community for reaching 2K followers quite recently. Now I have had to shift when I'm doing that 40 hour stream back. Originally, it was supposed to be starting at 3 p.m. UK time, ready for when the game was supposed to be going live. Now, as they've moved the time back, it does now mean I'm going to be starting my stream at roughly 6.30 a.m on Tuesday the 28th of September. That is UK time. I appreciate that it's a very early start, so a lot of you probably will not be there. Maybe those Americans in my community will probably actually like this because it'll be an evening time for you. Um, I apologize for this, but as you can imagine, I want to make sure the stream starts when New World starts, so that is the new plan. So therefore, I will end be ending stream at roughly 6.30 a.m. on Thursday the 30th of September. Ugh. I hope you guys will be able to join me for the 40 hour stream. I'm really looking forward to it. The last thing I wanted to discuss then in this kind of new world wrap up video before it goes live is all about my plan for future videos and content on this channel for new world. So I've been thinking for a while about whether I actually want to do uh, properly edited new world videos. And the issue is with the amount of in real life stuff I've got going on right now, I'm probably going to struggle to record and edit and upload content for new world. I, to be honest, quite struggle quite often getting even my DVD videos out on time. And considering the majority of those videos are going to be videos on updates or, you know, hints and tips and stuff like that, to be honest, there are so many other YouTubers already doing this that make content better than me and upload it quicker than me. And therefore, me using my time to do that is probably going to be not really very useful to uh, my community. So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm actually going to take the plunge into YouTube Shorts. Uh, I'm going to continue to make my DVD videos and highlight videos as fully edited videos as you guys are used to, uh, as well as my Foul Plays playlist as well. But for new world content, I'm actually going to be making new world shorts. These are gonna be short, snappy videos with hints and tips and tricks for all different parts of the game. I might at some point do longer videos for new world if it's something special, like a particularly good dungeon run or particularly good, uh, you know, offensive war attack or something like that you've seen in the past. But you can expect to see a lot of New World shorts on this channel soon. I hope you guys are going to vibe with them quite well and I would appreciate feedback when they do start to come out. There we go then, that wraps up this uh, Coop Corner Chat episode 28, all about New World and its release. Hopefully some of this information has been useful to you and if you stuck out this video to the end, I really appreciate it. I look forward to the 40 hour stream and seeing New World go live, I hope you guys do too. But as always, this has been Coop Corner Chat, I've been Foulplay Gaming, stay wholesome.